Lego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. So there Captain Jack Sparrow was, a prisoner aboard the Queen Anne's Revenge, faced by the woman Pete Wrong. Also, there were few zombies. Creepy thing zombies, of which he was definitely not a fan. He kept hearing this very annoying clunking sound. Of course, being the ingenious and stealthy Captain Jack Sparrow, he speedily made his escape. And where else to hide? The captain's own cabin. Bottles full of tiny ships. Of course, no one had told Captain Jack just who that captain's cabin's captain happened to be. Blackbeard. The most dreaded pirate of all the seven seas. Night in White Cap Bay. The game was afoot. The hunters, a scurvy band of Blackbeard's pirates and ew, zombies. The quarry, horrible, terrifying, man-eating mermaids. Really much scarier than it sounds. The unwilling bait? Well, I'll let you take a guess. It was up to Captain Jack to lure a mermaid into range. He did his best to draw one of the lovely creatures close. And that is another reason why Captain Jack doesn't like to work with zombies. Terrible depth of perception. He prefers not to work with crumbling stone towers either. It seems young Philip did better. And that is how Captain Jack Sparrow caught a mermaid.